Hey guys, Eli Valderrama here. Another incredible day in Puerto Peñasco, Sonora, Mexico, also known as Rocky Point. As you guys have heard, the Lukeville border is um, closed right now and we don't know for how long. So I wanted to share my experience on crossing back from the United States back to Rocky Point. First stop, Dateland. And I hear they have world famous date, the fruit date shakes. So let's check it out. Dateland came through. The date shake is delicious. So we went through the closest area by Yuma, which is San Luis, Colorado. And there's two options. You either go down around the Gulf which is a little bit less than three hours or you go on the two highway to Sonoita which basically hugs the border and we upped it on that road and it was beautiful first of all no potholes no potholes beautiful scenery desert landscaping very wide road so if you need an off shoulder a little bit of um, easement there it was totally smooth straightforward easy so I'll let you know how the next one goes when we head back to the United States. Hey guys, as promised, I have an update about crossing the border back from Rocky Point to the United States right now that the Lukeville border is closed. The US and here's what we found out. He decided to go on the two highway which hugs along the border. And again, it was super smooth, easy, straightforward because there's no potholes no potholes so it's a straight fly through to San Luis Colorado and from what I understand if you have your passport card the card you can get through faster and there's a useful app that will allow you to see what is the best time to cross all right so I'll see you guys here at Rocky Point have an awesome day hasta pronto mm -hmm.